the season, the two things that, that concerned me were taking care of the basketball and then solidifying our defense, making that more of, a, of an identity with us. Um, I think our defense is starting to sh sure up in the half court. Uh, we, still, we still have a ways to go in terms of taking care of the basketball and, and valuing that thing in every possession and understanding the value of, of getting a shot every time down the floor. This year, well, last year, guys had it was their first time coming into those roles. A lot of us, like me, Tate, Tim, it was our first time. So we got another year under our belt. Um, our half-court defense is way better than last year, as of right now. So that's that's a huge part in our game. Um, we got, I mean, we have we have the talent for sure. We just have to get those steps and those little things to come together and we'll be we'll be all right you hear the you hear the vocal communication i think is probably the biggest thing last year no one talked um you know whether they were a, a senior or a freshman we couldn't get anybody to talk on this team last year that was our biggest void now you can start to hear the juniors talk um, it's very evident that you know on our white team which is is some of our older guys they're a lot more vocal. Our gold team, which has got you know four freshmen, either redshirt freshmen or true freshmen, um, they're quiet and, and, he, and it affects their play. So the quicker they start to understand that, uh, the quicker they're going to start seeing the, the results that they want. Like Coach Hill always said, he was asking me and Tate and other guys, Connors, to be leaders, but we hadn't really. It was our first time being on the court and playing that role, so we hadn't proved ourselves yet. So now we've proven ourselves. Guys kind of know like who to follow, who not, who not to follow. So yeah, I think there's more of like a culture this year than there was last year. I, I don't know if, if um, I don't know if there's one guy. I think it's been a, a collective group amongst those juniors. Uh, you really saw. Those guys uh, be focused this offseason with the first time NCAA allowing us to work guys out in the summer, those eight weeks, and, and then obviously because of the trip to Australia, you can see some definite maturity on, on the court. Um, you know, I really like, uh, I, one thing I like right now is, is, how, is how cerebral Connor Osborne is. Even from a center position, he thinks the game extremely well and it helps, helps our younger guys figure out some things on the fly, which is going to pay big dividends down the stretch. I mean, when you first get here freshman year, everything's so fast paced and everything's just moving. So by now, I mean, I feel like I, I'm slowed down and I, I'm able to see it and, and see the court real well. So yeah, I, I'd say that everything has kind of slowed down. We've, we've tried to uh, uh, temper it up a little bit. We've got some guys that are banged up, Tate Unruh, Emmanuel Adu. Got some guys that got some, some nagging injuries, nothing serious. So we've tried to be smart as a staff and, and uh, uh, get a feel for what their legs are feeling like. And so, so far, so good. Other than the, the nagging injuries, I don't think we're beating them up too bad. And no doubt, they get, no doubt they get long. Um, we always do a little halftime break, and that kind of lets us know that we, got, we still got another half, like another half of practice to go. So when we bring it up, we try and keep say things to keep it keep it going, keep it strong. Try it's just keeping the energy up the whole time is pretty much what really helps. If you keep talking the whole practice, it uh, it definitely keeps it up, energy up. Uh, I think we're still going strong, but I mean, there's going to be points that we're going to run into practice where we might have have a bad practice that we're going to have to push through and really pick it up the next day and so on and so forth. But I mean, as of right now, I feel good, the team feels good, so I just think that we're in a good spot.